This web application is a fully equipped radionic instrument with base 10, base 44, base 12 and base 336 capabilities. It has a built-in potentizer for making of potentized radionic remedies. With a built-in remedy rate book you can fast and efficiently search and pick rates for immediate broadcasts or remedy making. The instrument is web browser based, therefore an installation is not necessary. You need to unlock the instrument by typing your name in, and copy and paste your personal key into the second field. By pushing the, unlock, button, the instrument has become fully functional and is personalized to your name. The instrument is built on the schemes of an original Delaware instrument. You can have a look inside the instrument by clicking on the interior button at any time. The plates in the interior of the instrument are set according to the dial settings on the front plate. To return to the front plate touch the Show Front Panel button. The witness or the matter to be informed can be placed on the witness plate. You can use the virtual instrument in different modes. First, you can manually type in rates from any rate book you have available. Start with selecting the rate base you want to use by touching the according buttons. The dials will change in accordance to your choice. You can touch the field, touch and set a rate. The input panel will appear. Please use the buttons to type in any rate you want to have. There are additional buttons for space, dot or minus, which are necessary to input rates for a specific rate system properly. By touching the enter button the rate is immediately set. You can now choose a color for your treatment if you wish. The set color is shown by the color of a text on the top of the color button list. You can change the color at any time. Normally the time for a base 10, 44 or 336 rate is 5 minutes or 300 seconds. However you can change the duration of the broadcast with the slider between 1 to 900 seconds. So at max treatment durations of 15 minutes are possible. Optionally you can switch on the potentizer. The potentizer will alter the signal by expanding it in a 1 to 10 ratio, producing D or X potencies according to the set rate. You can see the graphical expression of this expansion if you take a look to the interior of the instrument. By touching the start button the broadcast starts. While the broadcast is running, a red bar underneath the witness plate is shown and the color appears on the witness plate and is rhythmically added to the broadcast. You can stop the broadcast at any time with the stop button and reset the instrument with the reset button. The second method to use the instrument is to choose rates from the rate catalog. For this, you touch on search for rates and list. On the second screen, choose the type of rate you want to use by touching the item on the corresponding list. By touching the final rate value, the rate is added to the broadcast list. You can select different remedies subsequently and add them to the broadcast list. To remove a rate from the broadcast list, you simply touch on it, and it will disappear. By touching, start broadcast, the instrument will automatically start the broadcast of the chosen rates. Standard duration for base 10, 44 and base 336 with 5 minutes will be chosen automatically, while base 44 rates will be broadcasted 2 minutes and 12 seconds. You can stop the broadcast at any time with the stop button. The third option is the programmed run of multiple broadcasts including the display of an witness on the witness plate. Click on the program mode button to switch to the program mode window. Here you can select all parameters for an individual broadcast and can add this broadcast to a list for later processing. As an example, we start with a totally manual input of all data. We select base 12 as rate base, and green as color. Now we click on the name field and type in the identifier for the target of the broadcast, which may be for example the name of a person or an animal. Click the rate field, and type in an appropriate rate, by using the number buttons below. You have a space, a minus and a comma button available. The C button clears the selected field. By clicking on a field, it is automatically highlighted and cleared. We now set a figure for the number of repetitions we need, for pause and hours in between the broadcasts and whether we want to have the potentizer running with the broadcast. When we have filled in all data, we can click on Add to Broadcast List button to add this broadcast to the list. Rates can also be selected by clicking on the search button. The search page opens and you can select like before a suitable rate. By choosing the rate, the rate is inserted directly into the rate box. 
especially for base 10 rates, you may wish to use the method of giving something into somewhere or to double organ rates for balancing. You can do so by clicking again on the search button and select a second rate, which is then added to the rate box in the appropriate way. You can add this broadcast to list as before. To erase a line from the broadcast list, you simply click on it and the line is erased. To start the broadcast, you click on Start Broadcast. The front panel is shown and the instrument starts to work down the list and repeat the broadcasts according to the timetable. To stop an individual broadcast you can click on Stop on the front panel. To stop the program run, you switch to the program mode again and click on Stop. The broadcast list can be cleared by clicking on Clear List on the top of the window. If you want, the broadcasts are logged. The Log Broadcasts box has to be marked. A list of all broadcasts can be displayed with the Display Log File button. You can clear the log file by clicking on a Clear Log File button. You can now go back to the front panel. The instrument is stored on your computer as an offline application so you don't need to be connected with the Internet all time. Thank you for your attention and a fun and success with the virtual radionic instrument for tablet computers.